Hello, I'm Dr. Petrache, diabetologist. Today, I'm talking about the most effective drugs and natural remedies recommended in diabetic neuropathy. Neuropathy is a term used to describe several types of peripheral nerve damage that can lead to various symptoms. Neuropathy is a common complication of diabetes, but also a negative effect of chemotherapy. There is treatment for neuropathy, however, it does not cure the nerve damage, but only reduces its symptoms. Peripheral neuropathy is a condition that leads to weakness, pain and numbness of the extremities, especially the hands and feet. Peripheral nerves send messages from the brain and spinal cord to the entire body. When these nerves are destroyed, these messages are interrupted and can affect how the body responds to pain, temperature and other reflexes. Several conditions can lead to peripheral neuropathy, including diabetes, trauma, alcohol and infection. The effects of peripheral neuropathy may appear suddenly or may gradually extend over time. The treatment depends on the main condition that led to the onset of the neuropathy. Many natural and traditional methods focus on relieving symptoms. The symptoms depend on the affected nerves. There are three types of nerves, matter, sensory and autonomic. The matter nerves send messages from the brain to the muscles for optimal control of movement. If the condition affects the matter nerves, you may experience symptoms that include muscle weakness or muscle atrophy, difficulty moving your arms and legs, muscle spasms and decreased reflexes. Sensory nerves send messages from the body to the brain. When you experience a cold sensation or touch something sharp, you use sensitive nerve cells. When the condition is at this level, you will feel numbness, excessive sensitivity to touch, inability to feel the temperature, but also loss of reflexes and coordination. The autonomic nerves control involuntary and semi-voluntary functions, including blood pressure, heart rate, bladder function and sweating. If the autonomic nerves are affected, you will experience symptoms such as nausea, vomiting, dizziness, while standing or when moving from a sitting to an upright position, excessive sweating, inability to control the bladder, but also the intestines, irregular heartbeats, but also difficulty in swallowing. Treatment for peripheral neuropathy depends on the cause. Let's talk about the drag drugs that you can use for this complication of diabetes. An effective treatment for neuropathy is alpha-lipoic acid. This is an antioxidant that can be useful in the treatment of diabetes-induced neuropathy or in the treatment of cancer. It can help lower blood sugar, improve nerve function and reduce symptoms in hands and feet, pain, itching, numbness, stinging and burning. Alpha-lipoic acid can be given orally or intravenously. Among the foods that have traces of alpha-lipoic acid, they mention liver, red meat, broccoli, is spinach, but also Brussels sprouts. Acetyl L-carnitine is an amino acid and antioxidant. It can increase energy levels and reduce pain in people with neuropathy. It can be given as a supplement in a dose of 500 mg twice a day. Foods that contain acetyl L-carnitine are 
meat, fish, but also dairy products. According to a recent study, acetyl l carnitine successfully treated peripheral neuropathy caused by chemotherapy as well as cancer related fatigue. And acetyl cysteine is also an amino acid and an antioxidant. Among its effects are the treatment of neuropathic pain and the reduction of inflammation. It can be given as a supplement in a dose of 1200 mg twice a day. So we talked about the drugs. Let's see now a few natural remedies for polyneuropathy. Vitamins. Some cases of peripheral neuropathy are related to a lack of vitamins. Vitamin B is essential for the nerve health and the lack of vitamin B can lead to a significant nerve damage. B vitamins are useful in the treatment of neuropathy because they help maintain the health of the nervous system. Peripheral neuropathy is sometimes caused by vitamin B deficiency. Supplements should include vitamins B1, B6 and B12. You can take them separately or you can take them together. Vitamin B1 or benfotiamine reduces pain and inflammation to prevent cell destruction. Also, B12 deficiency leads to peripheral neuropathy. Left untreated, this can lead to complete nerve damage. Among the foods rich in vitamin B, I mentioned pork, chicken, fish, seafood, eggs, dairy products, but also vegetables. Vitamin B supplements have the power to help restore nerve function precisely because B vitamins can generally accelerate cell regeneration. B vitamins help relieve pain and fight inflammation. Vitamin D can also prevent nerve pain, the skin normally produces vitamin D in response to sunlight. Vitamin D deficiency can lead to neuropathic pain. The second natural remedy is cayenne pepper. It contains capsaicin, an ingredient in hot peppers. Capsaicin is often used in creams for its pain-relieving properties. It decreases the pain signal sent to the body. Adding cayenne pepper to your diet is, or taking it as a supplement can reduce your neuropathic pain. Capsaicin creams can also be used successfully, even if they initially cause a burning sensation. Continued use will gradually reduce the pain. Turmeric is an aromatic plant used in the kitchen known for its anti-inflammatory, antioxidant and analgesic properties. It can help reduce numbness and pain in the hands and feet. Turmeric can be taken as a food supplement, can be used in the kitchen or can be drank as tea. Fish oil is also useful in the treatment of neuropathy due to its anti-inflammatory effects and its ability to repair damaged nerves. It can be taken as a dietary supplement. The omega-3 fatty acids found in fish oil can be found in foods such as salmon, sardines, rapeseed oil, chia seeds, flax seeds, mackerel, cod, herring, shells, anchovies, caviar, but also soy. Quitting smoking. Smoking affects circulation. The blood vessels are narrowing and less and less oxygenated blood reaches the periphery. Without good blood circulation, it is very possible to experience numbness and pain. Quitting smoking can help. Hot bath can reduce the pain sensation. Warm water increases blood circulation through the body and decreases the symptoms of neuropathy. If the sensory nerves are affected by peripheral neuropathy and you are not sensitive to temperature, make sure the water is not too hot. 
Regular exercise can help you fight pain and improve your health. If you are active, you can lower your blood sugar, which will further reduce or slow down your nerve damage. Exercise increases blood flow to the hands and feet. All of these factors help reduce discomfort and pain. Essential oils, including chamomile and lavender, help increase circulation in the body. These oils can also help fight pain, reduce inflammation and ultimately speed healing. Meditation can also help people who are struggling with the symptoms of neuropathy. It can reduce stress and pain. In addition, this method is non-invasive and brings benefits in many ways. Acupuncture promotes natural healing by stimulating certain pressure points in the body. This technique forces the nervous system to release chemicals that can reduce pain. In short, Prevention works better than any treatment. Keeping your blood sugar in check will help prevent neuropathy. If neuropathy is alcohol-related, stop drinking immediately to prevent the worsening of neuropathy. Natural remedies are successful in relieving the pain caused by peripheral neuropathy. However, talk to your doctor before trying them. That's it for today. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell and like the video. I am Dr. Petrake and until next time, take care of your body and soul.